See, this is what, what leads me to believe that Disney thinks that we're all morons. Is that they do they do something like this. They hire Shamin Obed Chinoy as a director. And they put it out there in the in the mainstream media outlets that this is fantastic because Shermino Bechnoy is the first woman of color to direct a, a Star Wars movie. And, and that in itself is fantastic. See, Disney believes that that's where the story ends. They, they believe that they're still operating in 1980 when we didn't have our Googles. Disney believes that we passionate Star Wars fans are not going to look up who this unknown director is. This, this director who was entrusted with, with a multi-billion dollar franchise that is beloved by fans across the world. Disney believes that we simply won't care that this individual went on camera, went on stage, and had the gall to say this. I like to right make here. men uncomfortable. I enjoy <laughs> making men uncomfortable. <laughs> but you see, Disney and Kathleen Kennedy, Bob Iger, these these people, these executives over at Disney, they knew that, that they, they made a huge mistake. They knew that hiring this activist, self-proclaimed activist, was a huge mistake because everywhere from cnn to fox news to all these all these mainstream media outlets were covering the fact that we star wars fans did not like the fact that disney and lucasfilm hired an activist that likes to make men feel uncomfortable we hated this no one likes this no one wants this and and, and disney once again after having the worst year ever 2023 they were looking to start off 2024 with fan backlash. I mean, everywhere, everyone was covering how, how, how woke Disney was once again, how stupid this decision was. So this is what Disney did. And this is where Disney believes that you are a moron. They did this. They announced that Jon Favreau was going to make a Mandalorian movie. That's right. In order to, to change the conversation from them hiring an activist that likes to make you, make the men feel uncomfortable, Disney decided to announce that Jon Favreau was going to make a Mandalorian movie. And what's more, no longer is the Rey movie next up to bad. No, no, no. She got pushed back. Now, the next Star Wars movie that's going to come out is going to be the Mandalorian movie directed by Jon Favreau. Now, I keep saying directed by Jon Favreau. That's because that's what Disney wants you to shift your attention to. Oh. They want you to forget the fact that their new Star Wars Ray director said this. Let's listen to it one more time. Um, I like to make men uncomfortable. I enjoy <laughs> making men uncomfortable. Disney wants you to forget because they think you're dumb. They want you to forget that she is still the director for the Ray movie and she's going to continue to be the director. They're not they're not going to get rid of her. She's here to stay, ladies and gentlemen. But here's the thing. If you make the horrible decision of taking your kids to go see her Star Wars Ray movie, just know that her intention is not to entertain you. No, no, no. Her intention is to make you uncomfortable, to make your children uncomfortable, and especially if they're young men. Anyway, guys, you guys let me know what you think down in the comments. And like always, don't forget to subscribe. Sensational.